whether Justin Trudeau can lead the Liberals in the next election after Christia Freeland lost her traditionally safe Liberal seat in a by-election. Good afternoon, Marika Walsh with the Globe and Mail. Um, Deputy Prime Minister, can the Prime Minister still stay on to lead the Liberal Party into the next election, given that you just lost one of the safest seats in the entire country last night? Yes, he certainly can. Can you explain why? Because everybody we're hearing from behind the scenes believes that the result last night means catastrophic losses across the country. If you cannot win in Toronto under Justin Trudeau, why should, he, why should anybody believe you can win anywhere else under him? Our government is focused on working hard for Canada and Canadians and on delivering results for Canada and Canadians. That is what the Prime Minister is focused on. That is what we are all focused on. The Prime Minister is committed to leading us into the next election, and he has our support. The weight of leadership is undeniable. The unexpected loss of a long-held safe seat sends shockwaves, hinting at growing dissatisfaction with Justin Trudeau's leadership. Christia Freeland's defense of Trudeau is seen more as a pledge of loyalty to the party than a true gauge of public opinion. This defeat highlights voters' discontent, signaling a potential need for leadership overhaul to regain trust. The by-election result isn't just a local issue. It's a loud, resounding rejection of the current Liberal Party's policies. Voters are clamoring for a shift towards fiscal responsibility, economic growth, and enhanced public safety. Freeland's response, perceived as evasive, emphasizes her dedication to Canadians without addressing the specific election grievances. Trust is the cornerstone of effective governance, and maintaining Trudeau's leadership despite this loss could further erode public confidence in the Liberals' ability to lead by focusing inward on party unity rather than outward on the root causes of voter dissatisfaction, the liberals risk prioritizing their cohesion over the very public interests they serve.